White and the Grays. Black, White, and the Grays are Trey and Kylie Gray and their family, and they run a market farm. If you ever wondered how to garden in a hardiness zone where you could get frost any of the 365 days a year, Black, White, and the Grays are proof you can do it. You may have to do it over and over again, but you can do it. The face of the channel is Kylie, and she takes us along for all the fun moments of growing their own food, as well as some of the not-so-fun times. Like when they found out that their family milk cow was part Pokemon. <laughs> their cow is Jigglypuff. You guys don't believe me, do you? She's like one of those punch balloons that punches back. Entering Pokemon tournaments, that's not why they keep the cow, though. Black, White, and the Grays is determined to be able to feed their family through the ups and downs of climate or economic storms and knowing where the majority of their food comes from, that is definitely a head start. So if you like walking the fine line between beating the bad weather and growing food well into the frost dates, or just see how a market garden operates, you just may be amazed by the black, white, and the grays. Big Bite Bassin. Are you into the fast-paced world of bass fishing? What do you mean? <laughs> There's no such thing. <laughs> Big Bite Bassin compiles his videos down to segments that are mostly um, 10 minutes or less, although if you're looking for something to watch that lasts as long as morning constitution he's got some that go a few minutes longer ah uh, he turned his thumb into fish num nums <laughs> but it's all bass all the time here except maybe that one time big bite bass and shows that bass fishing isn't always a relaxing and inspiring adventure sometimes it's like got it don't got it got it don't got it <laughs> But the most entertaining are the DIYs, like how to hook yourself. He did a better job with that piercing than the pros do. It's only happened twice, and I'm sure it was just as funny the first time it happened. So if you like seeing bass and tons of fingers and bass mouths, <laughs> Big Bite Bass and has all the bass and only a little of the sass. Check him out. Ashada's Family Farm. The Ashada's Family Farm hit the YouTube ground running two months ago. And they've been pumping out homestead videos every few days since. The homestead they live on has been part of their family heritage for decades. Great granddad built it. And Ashada's Family Farm has spent their time on YouTube showing the neat ways they preserve their harvest and even forage their farm for wild edibles. It's all a part of Lara's master plan to encourage simple living and the back to the basics philosophy of times gone by. They even make organic herbal syrups with turbine engines, <laughs> I think. <laughs> what do they think of next? Well, they even show how to revive a tired old act. Technically, they're Washington Raisins. So if you're into homestead channels, simple living, or names that are difficult to pronounce, <laughs> come see what Ashada's Family Farm has lined up for you. Oregon's favorite market farm. Fishing bass and kissing. Ah, y'all thought something terrible, didn't you? <laughs> Washington's Family Heirloom Homestead. Are these your people? 